I don't trust anyone personally, and I think that's what's happening with Labour and uh, Conservative. I think Labour's got in now because of uh, how Conservatives run the country. But watch his space. You know what he says. I hope he does. But uh, you know what? Hold my breath on that one. There's nothing to judge him by. I mean, there has been some good Labour leaders in the past, but whether he'd be one of them, I think he was a solicitor on account or something. He, he was in some profession. He, he, he seems uh, plausible enough, but there again, they all do. He's probably not going to tick all my boxes. I think he's been worryingly passive on the Israel-Palestine issue, but I think that he knows what he's doing. He knows that if he basically remains passive on most things, the Tory party is self-destructing in front of us. So if he can avoid as many difficult interviews and conversations as possible, I think the election will essentially win itself for him. And he probably knows that. And we'll get a better picture of who he is as a person and a politician um, when he's in power, if he gets to power. I think it's a flip-flop. He decides one week he wants to vote one thing and he wants to vote one thing, another, another thing, completely opposite. I honestly don't trust him. And I know he's head of the polls, and if he gets in, I think, God help us. And that's the truth. I really do believe that.